Open Broadcaster Software Studio, or more commonly OBS Studio, is a free, open source streaming and recording program. When combined with audio and video editing software, it's a powerful and flexible screencast video production tool. In this video from Envato Tuts Plus, we'll show you how you can set up and start recording video quickly with OBS Studio. Before we go into setting up OBS, let's run through a couple of other methods for screen recording. You're probably aware of other popular alternatives to OBS Studio for screen recording, applications like Camtasia and ScreenFlow. These are good all-in-one solutions that let you both record and edit video, though they do lack the live streaming option of OBS. Another option is to separate your screen recording from the audio and video editing, using different software for each. You might already have a video editing program, in which case, why buy another? In the case of this tutorial, we'll assume that you're looking to follow this approach, using OBS Studio simply to do the screen recording, and doing your more in-depth video editing elsewhere. First, you'll need to download and install OBS Studio from their website and follow the instructions, including choosing whether you'll be mostly streaming or recording. When you launch OBS, this is the screen you'll see. The software uses scenes and sources, which work together to help you efficiently manage your audio, video and production assets. OBS will automatically place a scene for you to start with in the bottom left-hand corner. Before you can record, you'll need to add a source to the scene. With Scene selected, click the plus button at the bottom of the source panel, and depending on your operating system, choose Screen Capture or Display Capture. Name your source something relevant and hit OK. You'll see the screen equivalent of holding two mirrors up to one another. Don't worry, that's normal. If you've got more than one monitor, you can choose from the display drop-down box which one you would like to record from and hit OK. It'll still look really strange, but that's alright. Now we'll make sure that your recording is saving in the right folder. At the bottom right of the screen, hit Settings and choose Output from the left-hand menu. In the Recording Path field is the destination that your video will be saved to, so if it's not right, you can change it now. If you're ready to begin recording, you can now hit Start Recording in the bottom right-hand menu. When you're finished, hit Stop Recording and your video will save to the folder that you specified in the previous steps. So, now you've got OBS Studio all set up and you're ready to get started with screen recording. Thanks for watching and we hope you'll join us for more tutorials here at Envato Tuts Plus.